Hello, in this video we have 7 to the power of 5 to the power of x equals to 5 to the power of 7 to the power of x. And we have to find the value of x, so we have solution. So we can start by taking the log to base 5 of the both sides of this equation we're going to have. Log in base 5 of we have 7 to the power of 5 to the power of x. And this is equal to we have log in base 5 of we have 5 to the power of 7 to the power of x. So 5 to the power of x will come behind this log and we have 7 to the power of x will come behind this log. So you're going to have 5 to the power of x log of 7 in base 5 equals to we have 7 to the power of x log of 5 in base 5. So this will give us 5 to the power of x log of 7 in base 5 and this is equals to 7 to the power of x because log of 5 in base 5 is 1. So because we still have x here at the exponent we can take another log. So we're going to have log in base 5 of 5 to the power of x log of 7 to base 5 and this is equals to log in base 5 of 7 to the power of x. So recall that if you have log of a times b is simply equals to log of a, we have plus log of b. And we are going to apply this identity here. So this will give us, we're going to have log of 5 to the power of x to base of 5 then we have plus we have log of into we have log of 7 to base 5 and this is to base 5 so we have this is equals to this x here will come behind the log here so we're going to have x times log of 7 to base 5 so what next? Similarly, this x will come behind this log. We're going to have x times log of 5 to base 5. We have plus log in base 5 of log of 7 to base 5. And this is equals to x times we have log of 7 to base 5. So this is what we're going to have here. Now let's take this x log of 5 to base 5 to this part of this equation and this will give us we're going to have log in base 5 of we have log of 7 to base 5 and this is equals to we have x log of 7 to base 5 minus we have x log of 5 to base 5. So let's continue in the next slide. So we have this log in base 5 of log of 7 to base 5 equals to x times log of 7 to base 5 minus x times log of 5 to base 5. There's x here, there's x here, so we can factor that out. And we have log in base 5 of, we have log of 7 to base 5, and this is equals to, let's factor this x out. We have x times log of 7 to base 5 minus log of 5 to base 5. And if you have log of a divided by b is simply equals to log of a minus log of b. So we're going to apply this here. So we're going to have log in base 5 of log of 7 to base 5 equals to, here we're going to have x times log in base 5 of 7 divided by 5 so let's try and make x the subject here so we can just divide here by log in base 5 of 7 over 5 and we divide here by log in base 5 of 7 over 5 so what will happen here is this will cancel this and this x here is now equals to the whole of this. So let's go to the next slide. So by rearranging the equation, we have x equals to log in base 5 
of log of 7 to base 5 divided by log in base 5 of 7 divided by 5. So you can leave your answer this way or you can have, let me write all here, x equals to, we have log in base 7 over 5 to log of 7 to base 5. Recall that if you have log of x to base of y is simply equals to log of x divided by log of y. So by using this identity, we can leave our answer this way. So that is it for the video. Please don't forget to subscribe and share to your friends. Thank you and goodbye.